Hey, it's Joe from Element 14. Today I'm going to show you how to set up Raspberry MC, which is a media center, using your Raspberry Pi and a wireless keyboard and mouse touchpad. We've put together a bundle to make it really easy and some instructions that you can follow. So here's what you get. The most important thing in your bundle is this Class 4 4GB SD card, and that comes preloaded with Raspberry MC. You don't need to worry about it updating itself or it being out of date because the version will automatically update as soon as it connects to the internet. Next up is an HDMI cable. You can use that to connect to your TV. You've also got an Ethernet cable. That's just so you can connect to your router the first time you boot it up. You don't need wired internet connection in the long run and you could just use a wireless dongle. The coolest thing we give you in the bundle is the Media Center controller. There's a QWERTY keyboard and a touchpad, and it connects wirelessly through this dongle here. Things you don't get in the bundle are the Raspberry Pi itself and the power supply. So let's connect it up. We want to put the power supply in last so that you've got everything else connected first. Make sure your SD card's connected firmly as well. So let's fire it up. So the first time you boot it up, it'll take a little while. When you get to the screen, what you'll see is the uh, menu appear, and that starts with weather on the left hand side, and you've got pictures, videos, music, and programs. So the bottom right hand side of the screen is where Raspberry MC will tell you whether it's updating apps or um, where it's connected to the internet. So that's more just for information. So the first thing you're going to want to do is add your own videos. So if you go to videos, then files, just press OK on your keypad. Then we go to files again. Add videos. Then we're going to browse. So what you'll see when you go to browse is that it'll bring up a whole load of different network options. So in this case, what we're going to try and do is connect through Windows Network, because we have a, uh, a network storage device. So what you'll see here is uh, the folder. You should be able to recognize your own uh, file folders here to navigate to your own films. So what we're doing is just browsing through our network storage drive here. So we're going to go to Movies. And you'll find everything that we've got stored here. So the next video we're going to do, I'll show you how to add your films to the library. Thank you for watching, I hope that was useful to get you up and running with Raspberry MC. There's loads more resources on element14.com, you'll be able to find all the tutorials on there. But until next time, have fun with it and uh, good luck!